Okay. Alright, so it's like 5.30 in the morning and I'm gonna start to get ready because today's spin day! Spin day! Yeah! So we need a lot of energy for spin day. I actually really enjoy spinning. It's just, you know, tired. I'm a week out from a wedding, a little bit stressed. Um, but this is a good stress reliever, so there is no skipping workouts at this point in the game, and uh, and we gotta get we gotta get going. So I'm gonna go make a little coffee after this, brush my teeth, and uh, I'll meet you at the gym. Hey guys, I am already in the spin room. I'm always the first one here because I like to do a little pre-workout warm up to get ready for the killer road ahead. Um, I'm already out of breath, so I guess that's a good sign. So I'll catch you when I'm really hot and red and sweaty, and we'll do a little post-workout snack. Okay, see you then. Hey guys, so I just got out of my spin class. This is what a badass workout looks like. Really red, really sweaty, I'm exhausted, but I feel great, and I'm so ready for a little post-workout snack. So come back to my kitchen, and I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna eat. Okay guys, I'm all recovered after my first spin workout. I've already answered some emails and run a few little morning errands and I'm ready to make a quick breakfast. So I just finished up my weight training session with my trainer. I try to see him about three times a week on the same days that I do my spinning or my cardio so I'm not doubling up on the weights. Um, and I'm starving right now so I'm going to go make myself a little something for, for lunch. Something that's really high in protein that of course is going to refuel after that workout. So let's go do it. Again, I know I'm looking a little different than I was before, um, but we've been filming some Abby's Kitchen videos here today, and I'm just getting ready to set up for another one. So this is around the time I need a quick little bit of energy, a nice little snack to get me through the next few uh, few recipes. So I'm going to get to that right now. So we're just wrapping up, we're just cleaning everything up and getting all the food put away, um, but I need a little quick something something to get me through the rest of this cleanup. So I'm going to go make myself a quick little snack. Hey guys, so I'm about to have a little dinner, so I'm going to make something for myself. Um, and I know you're probably thinking, that girl's eating so many times throughout the day, and I know I am. I'm eating frequently because of course it's the last week before my wedding and I'm working out more so I need to fuel those workouts. And I think that's one of the big mistakes that a lot of brides make is that they cut calories so low that by the time they get to the honeymoon, they totally rebound because their metabolism is so shot. So I haven't done that. I've really focused on getting really good quality food in and feeling satiated and just feeling good. And it's working. So I'm gonna make my little meal here and I'll see you soon. Surprise, surprise guys, snack number three. I love baby bells. I always have baby bells in the fridge for an easy, quick snack, and I'm gonna really enjoy these. Hey 
Hey guys, so I'm just getting ready to finish up my last snack of the night. This is a little cottage cheese with tons of almonds on top and some toasted coconut. Such a great snack. It is loaded with casein protein, which is a really slow digesting protein, so it keeps me fuller longer, which I really think is great. I don't wake up hangry. Um, and you know, I hope you really enjoyed my little what I eat in a day the week before my wedding. Um, it's gonna be fun. I'm gonna definitely do another one of these when I get back from the honeymoon so that you can kind of see how I incorporate healthy foods into my everyday balanced diet when I'm not trying to fit into a really tight, backless, not forgiving dress, if you know what I mean. Um, also, the thing that I want you to know is this whole time I've still been eating out and enjoying myself. I mean, even just the other day, I went out for dinner, I had dessert, I had a beer. It doesn't mean you cannot enjoy yourself. So it's all about, you know, moderation and balance. So I hope you guys loved this. Um, if you did, please give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below about, of course, what you're making for dinner and what you're eating today. Um, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next time on Abby's Kitchen. Good night.